Hey guys, I'm here with Elliot Mello from Bridgestone Golf. He's going to talk us through the new fitting system here. It's pretty revolutionary. Elliot, tell us all about it. Yeah, so we're introducing VFET video ball fitting this week. We're, we're very excited about it. You know, you think about what is a launch monitor? A launch monitor is a, a high speed camera and a sophisticated computer. Well, everybody has a high speed camera in their pocket now. And so we have a sophisticated computer at our office. So that we have the total equation to conduct our fittings. And so what we do is we have the golfer do a uh, slow mo video of their swing. They submit that swing to BridgestoneGolf.com and then we virtually fit them remotely. And what we're doing is we're analyzing swing speed, ball velocity, launch angle, spin rate, carry distance, total distance, all the important stuff. And then we're also adding the layer of a golf ball recommendation. Um, it's a person to person experience, the personal element of the video being filmed and then our personal technician kind of going through the, the process, taking the time to understand that swing and that golfer's needs and then recommending the appropriate product for them. A lot of education in the industry about getting club fit, but do we really underestimate how important it is to get fit for your golf ball? Well, the golf ball is the one piece of equipment that you use on every shot. Okay, while there's certainly validity of getting fit for a driver, you may only hit it 14 times in a round. So the golf ball is being used tee through green, uh, and it's enormously important to get fit for it because uh, we see all the time where people go out and they spend a, a fairly large amount of money on a new set of clubs, but they're missing the key component, which is the golf ball. I guess uh, riding the wave of Tiger Woods uh, in the last couple of years particularly has been great. Explain the fitting process with him and uh, just how detailed it is. He's pretty... Uh, he's pretty good with it isn't it yeah for, for normal guys like us you know we're, we're looking at driver impact and that kind of paints a nice enough picture that we can get a fitting for someone like tiger he's looking at things as finite as launch angle on a 10 yard chip shot so he gets very granular with it and, and rightfully so i mean he's won uh he's won 15 majors out there and he's on his way to more what's he look for in a golf ball what's the number one thing tiger wants so, so Tiger grew up playing a lot of ball, a very high spin golf ball, right? And so when he keeps coming back to us, he says, I need it to spin. I'm going to dial spin back. So he's the opposite of a lot of the younger guys who work with. The younger guys want to add spin. Tiger's old school. He wants that high spin product to start with and dials it back as needed. And, you know, we have the new cover technology and the reactive material that Tiger helped us design. And he really pushed us for that higher spin because that's the control he's needing. If you've got one tip for the uh, amateur golfer back home, what is it when it comes to golf ball fitting? What's your, what's your number one tip? Be consistent with the golf ball that you play. So obviously I'd love for you to play a Bridgestone, but whatever model it is that you play, be consistent with it. Don't switch out during during the course of the year, especially don't switch out during the round uh, because every ball performs differently. So to know if that driver is really working or if that new swing tip is really working, uh, if you're changing the golf ball around, it's just another variable that's gonna kinda, kinda make the process more clunky. Well, there you have it, guys. If you're getting some new golf balls this year, make sure you get fit for them. Check out Bridgestone, be fit.